We're gonna use the BH Cosmetics third edition palette. It's actually my favorite palette to use because it has like a lot of really really neutral colors. I just pop that into my crease and on my lid I'm just gonna put like the lilac blue purpley kind of color on my lid and I started in the middle because it helps me blend my colors a little bit better. Oh, I'll be blinking so hard. <laughs> I pack my color on because it's a lighter color and it's fairly matte so when you pack the color on it gives you a much better color payoff. I'm using a flat brush to place the color. Then I'm gonna go with that beige just kind of color and I'm just gonna put it in the beginning of my lid and I'm gonna overlap it a little bit to blend the color in really really well. See? <laughs> Then I'm gonna go with like the, it's like a bluish kind of purple. It's kind of pale, but I'm just gonna pop that in my outer V. And I'm gonna overlap that color into that light lilac y type of color. Well, it's not really lilac, it's like, well, you see it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Then it's the eyeliner part. I'm not even gonna make it seem like I do it in one stripe because I absolutely do not. It takes me a little minute and I take my time and I connect the lines with well, the little dashes that I make. And this is a lot easier when you take your time because if you mess up, you're gonna be devastated. This eyeliner I got from the beauty supply store, it's like $1.99. I like it, it's liquid. It's like one of my favorite ones that I use. It's really about taking your time and, and really connecting the line, really. Like, don't rush because it's just not going to work out if this is something that's hard for you. pretty easy once you get the hang of it then I'm gonna put my lashes on these are my favorite lashes I'm not sure I think 
Ardell. Lash 385, they're like six bucks, but I love them. They're like my favorite lashes to wear. And they fit my eyes really, really good because they're kind of on the big side. So, yeah. Just play with it and, you know, like kind of move it and adjust it while it's still drying. Now I'm going on with my primer. I'm using Revlon Photo Ready Drugstore. It's probably like $13.99 now. When I was buying it, it was like... Not cheap. Oh, what I put on before was Nook of Magnesia because I have really, really oily skin. And I put it on and I let it dry. And then I put the primer over it. The foundation I'm using is L'Oreal True Match. And I mixed N7 and N9 and I blended. I blended with a um, beauty blender. Then under my eyes, I'm going under with Peach Luster from MAC the prep and prime highlighting pen looks really 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 natural um it's not really obvious it neutralizes any darkness under the eyes if you have it also um i'm technically like an nw5 n40 nw47 type of girl but i mix the two because i like it to be a little bit darker then i just blend it in with a flat brush go down my nose I go under with the beauty blender just to blend it in a little bit more by the way the beauty blender is damp now I'm going under my eye with banana powder from Ben Nye world famous then with my powder, my Studio Fix powder in NW50. I use 50 because it works for me. And I'm just using a regular fiber brush. I'm gonna put some mascara on L'Oreal, no, Maybelline Colossal Lash. One of my favorites. It doesn't run, um, it stays put, and you know, I'm cool with it. Now for my lipstick, I'm using Punk Couture from the Punk Couture collection. It has to be my favorite lipstick in the whole entire world. I love purple lipstick and it's matte and it's great and I'm in love with it and I'm happy and I stopped wearing it because I want to save it. I'm lining my lips with a eyeliner pencil I got from the Beauty Supply Store. It was like $1.99 in brown to make my lips really, really stand out. Now for my bronzer, I'm using CoverGirl Queen and Ebony Bronze. This is my favorite bronzer. I wear it every single day of my life because I'm not a huge fan of color like that, so I don't really put color on my cheeks, so bronzer is it for me. Now for this bronzer that I found in Walmart the other day. Sonia Cash Kush. I absolutely love it. It's like my whisper of guilt, which I, I don't have. So, you know, it, it does a job for me, so... And that's it. I hope you liked it. I hope you enjoyed. See you soon.